be followed by the International Indian Federation. Thank you, Mr. President. Third World Network views this diplomatic conference as an historic opportunity for the WIPO member states to fulfill their obligation under Article 15.1b of the International Covenant on Economic, Social and Cultural Rights, which the, this covenant recognizes the state's parties to the present convention. Let me quote from the convention, which recognize uh, the state parties to the present covenant, recognize the right of everyone to enjoy the benefit of scientific progress and its application. We call upon member states, while addressing the issue of the blind, visually impaired, and persons with reading disabilities, member states should approach the this issue with great degree of sincerity and to facilitate the access to materials in special format at affordable cost. Member states should keep the interest of present and future users at paramount. Please do not make unreasonable conditions to accommodate the commercial interest of the content industry. I wonder why the uh, film industry is so worried about this particular issue where we are discussing actually the uh, issues of uh, people with reading uh, disabilities. Film is supposed to be viewed. Uh, it, it's mainly talking about the books and other material, reading materials. However, the film industry is so concerned about this. So, uh, therefore, we are uh, repeating that we should not accommodate the commercial interest of the content industry at this uh, stage. In other words, the mechanism should be of user-friendly and should not contain cumbersome procedures. Member states should not make the past mistakes, repeat the past mistakes as uh, did it in WTO in 2003 or in the case of Bayern Appendix in 1971. Hence, there should, be, there should not be any accommodation of commercial interest through commercial availability. Further, the treaty should lay down uh, the following uh, in clear terms. Clear exemption from technologi uh, technological protection measures. Second, protect the right of individual to import the work of, uh, in special format. Third, do not impose the burden of com uh, commercial availability on requesting authorized institutions and individuals. Distinguished delegates, let us not repeat the past mistakes. Thank you.